How's it going everybody? This is Bang Bang Bow and I have a super quick review video for you. Uh, I'm a little bit under the weather, um, so I don't really want to be doing this, but I also do. Um, basically, DHO, I have other videos, you can look uh, at it. If you're looking at this video, you know about it, but the concept is you can punch things with it, okay? Really, I guess that's that's the main idea. Uh, it does work well as a knife. I've used it for many, many, many applications just for like a knife and it works well. Um, so I have not been unhappy with it. This is quite expensive, which you'll see. Um, and this is a first generation. Uh, I originally paid 220 for it and some of you <laughs> think I'm crazy for turning down offers, but I've gotten offers like over $600 for for this thing and, and I think it's because it's one of 50 um, so yeah I, I mean this thing is just my baby I, I love this and I can't wait I, I ordered two they have a bigger version where the hole is bigger everything's slightly bigger um, I got that for when I'm a bit older and my fingers get a little bit larger um, and then another regular one uh, and I got two different colors but once I get those, I'm going to be using those, and I'll just kind of put this away somewhere safe and, uh, you know, pass it down to, you know, people when I get older. So anyway, put that to the side. This thing, I, I just, I, I'll be honest, I got it because, you know, I found it, and it was significantly cheaper. This is $220, shipped to my house, $20. Like, you know, I it was kind of worth the gamble, um, and it, it's kind of sad because when a company comes out with a knockoff, it usually ends up destroying uh, the original creator. But in this case, this actually, uh, you know, in my opinion, has increased the value of this and just made another reason to get an actual JHO knife. Um, I got this, you know, in hopes that, okay, there maybe there's a cheaper option. It sucks. You know, we've all been there maybe getting a knockoff something, okay? I, I personally don't. I was thinking maybe I could get these for a couple of friends who just can't justify or wouldn't be comfortable carrying around a $200 knife, you know, just in case it gets lost. But if it's for self-defense, hey, maybe, you know, 20 bucks, you know, they'd be comfortable with it, even though it's kind of like an insult to the original creator. And if you're watching this original creator <laughs> um sorry i guess but anyway this thing is act like absolute crap i can't even and my fingers are very thin i cannot fit it through you know to function normally okay i can squeeze and it gets a little stuck on my ring finger and even then this thing is longer than the jho knife so i it, it it's horrible it's longer and thinner um, and there's no way that this would work in any hand but a hand that's like a child's. You know, someone too young to be, well, I mean, in some people's opinion, too young to be carrying around something like this, um, where they end up doing something stupid with it. Um, so yeah, it, it doesn't fit. It's total, total, absolute garbage, does not work, okay? Um, there's that. And it's just absolutely fucking hideous. Excuse my language, but like absolutely terrible. Look at that. And look at this. This is beautiful. And this is just horrible. I mean, I don't understand how you could have made a knockoff this bad. It Why even produce probably hunt, like thousands of these if... if you can't even use it. it's I don't understand okay um, I got this on mega knife and and please guys I you know this is basically the end of the review I mean it's absolute garbage you are literally throwing away twenty dollars because at the end of the day since you can't use it like like this you literally just have a knife that maybe you can use as like a box cutter but you know, you don't want to spend twenty dollars on a box cutter, and it, and it's just ugly. I just can't, I can't believe how bad, how bad this was done. And and a quick side note: if supposedly you're supposed to be able to put this on a keychain, which I guess is a good idea. Maybe I can use it for this. Um, 
Um, but, but yeah, and it came in like plastic packaging, this cardboard box, and uh, and that if, if anyone was interested. But yeah, that's that's basically the end of the review. I'm gonna see maybe. Oh, um, you know, it's not even worth doing like can it cut? But you know what I mean? Like it'll cut paper. I cut paper with it before. Um, but you you just please don't buy this. Um, you'll be wasting money, and you're better off just saving up for the next pre-order of a JHO Nug. Um, so yeah, um, thanks for watching this video, and like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. I'll be putting out realistically uh, one or two videos a month because trying to get a job and you know do adult stuff. Um, anyway, thanks for watching and have a nice day.